Okay, Pamo is uh, walking around the yard, and I'm starting the, the wrap-up of the day. It was our day ride on uh, Wednesday, June 4th, and this is Jumba Cat looking at us. Uh, we took off from our home here in North Knoxville. We uh, rode through Maribel, down to Gatlinburg on 321, then we got on 441 and crossed the mountain. Uh, then it, from the mountain over there we went to Cherokee and then over into Bryson City. And if you haven't been to Bryson City in a while, it's a cute little town. Hey, it's, it's kind of a small little tourist town. And uh, we ate dinner at Jimmy Max. And the reviews online gave it uh, great reviews. And boy, it really was. I had a big old giant cheeseburger and it was super, super. And Pam had a big old chicken sandwich chicken or new orleans chicken new orleans man, chicken sandwich it was man it was, it was actually cheese. so much food that we couldn't eat at all yeah, and it, was good. it had no room for dessert which is unusual for us on a ride and then uh, we walked around town for a little bit on in bryson city like I say it's a cute little town uh the only thing i know for sure is heath Schuler is from bryson city but we didn't see him today he, he must have been out of town and huh. then from uh there we took uh 19 which takes us way up in the mountains, and then we got on 28, which took us to Fontana Dam. If you, I know everybody sees all the local dams, but Pam and I had never been to Fontana Dam before, and if you have not seen it, it is spectacular. You get to go way up on top of the dam and look down into the, the thing that lets the water through. What was that thing called? The turbine or the gate or something? I don't know. Yeah, it was. Some chaos. Yeah, so you can look, look down. And it goes down hundreds and hundreds of feet. So, I mean, it's it's like some kind of movie. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> it kind of made us both kind of dizzy. So we got the hell out of there and went to the gift shop and saw a bunch of other people. And then from there, you take 28, and it brings you right at right at uh, Deals Gap, that little resort there at Deals Gap, uh, the Deals Gap store and the 129 store. So we stopped there, looked around. They were full of bikers. Uh, it was just a real beautiful day and then we went down the dragon and for us the dragon's not a whole lot of fun there were all these crazy bikers coming at us way too fast and kind of riding out of their lane it makes it's kind of unnerving for us but anyway we we enjoyed the scenery it's beautiful and then went just at the bottom of the dragon we it started sprinkling on us but not too bad and uh, we made it back into uh, Knoxville and the streets are wet here and our yards a little wet not too bad but so obviously we dodged the rain today and it's about we got home it's right now 10 after 7 we've just been home a couple minutes we left this morning at 10 and our total ride was 208 miles and Pamela I gotta ask you what was your favorite thing about the ride today uh, it was tossed up between the uh, grist mill and the dam oh yeah I forgot tell them about the grist mill I forgot about the grist mill I didn't mention it. <laughs> so it was right on 441 right going into get, Cherokee. Right before you get into Cherokee, it's, uh, it's a historic grist mill and it's, and it's uh, still in operation. They operate it during the summer hours and they show you how the mill was set up and how it makes wheat. And it was really, as Jeff would say, fascinating. fascinating. What was the name of it? A historic grist mill. Uh, no. Grimsley's Grims? Yeah, something like that. Gus's Grims yeah, Mill. Yeah, uh, we're gonna get in trouble. Oh yeah, okay. Um, it was, but it was really, it was really yeah, neat. It was, it was neat, and the and the people there were super nice, and uh, the it was just fascinating. 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 And my know. my favorite thing about the ride, I think, was the dam. It just uh, seen a lot of the dams, but this one being able to see down into that. What the heck? They had a name for that big thing that opened up, overfill or something. Any remember the sign that was yeah. working? But anyway, you you, you could you could stand up on top of it and look down, and it went down hundreds and hundreds of feet. You couldn't even see the bottom of it. And then they had uh, pictures of black and white photographs from the 40s. Yeah, they got they like a little started, museum there, kind of tells you about them, it. Or the dam, it history, was yeah, really incredible. Yeah, it was pretty neat. And but my favorite thing about the day is getting <laughs> home and kissing on the babies. Oh, that's always favorite. Mookie's thing. right here. This is our little girl. Mookie. Mookie. And those are the, are the two sisters. And Jumba. Butterbean and Pinker. All and right. And that's the Jumba Cat. Okay, that's I think. That's Pam's favorite. I think we've gone really long. All right, we've gone long this time, okay. but the day was fascinating. Fascinating. All right, thanks, honey. Bye bye.